news that will be front page of The Australian tomorrow and big news in the UK as well. Amid rising tensions in the Australia-China relationship, there has now been a major leak of official records from the Chinese Communist Party. It is believed to be the first leak of its kind in the world. A register with the details of nearly two million Communist Party members. It includes their name, party position, birth date, national ID number, ethnicity and in some cases even their phone number. What's amazing about this database is not just that it exposes people who are members of the Communist Party and who are now living and working all over the world from Australia to the US to the UK, but it's amazing because it, because it lifts the lid on how the party operates under President and Chairman Xi Jinping. But this leak shows that party branches are embedded in some of the world's biggest companies and even inside government agencies. That's right, Communist Party branches have been set up inside Western companies, allowing the infiltration of those companies by CCP members who, if called on, are answerable directly to the Communist Party, to the chairman, the president himself. Along with the personal identifying details of 1.95 million Communist Party members, mostly from Shanghai, there are also the details of 79,000 Communist Party branches, many of them inside companies. This leak, and it's going to be front page of The Australian tomorrow and a big story in the UK as well, is a significant security breach that is likely to embarrass the Chinese president. But it's also going to embarrass some global companies who appear to have no plan in, in place to protect their intellectual property from theft, from economic espionage.